all right guys welcome back to the channel today we're going to bust some of the craziest myths in blood strike that's right 10 myths each one crazier than the last some will leave you shaken and others well you'll see so grab your snacks buckle up and let's get to myth busting and here's a little teaser for you guys at the very end of this video we're going to bust a crazy myth that's been driving everyone nuts is emma's beetle drone really named luna or not if you've been wondering about this one make sure to stick around till the end to find out the truth you won't want to miss it first myth by it's chaco you can actually see the ammo decreasing in p90 inside your mag let's kick things off with this gem right here the myth is that you can literally see your ammo go down inside your magazine while you're firing. Sounds crazy, right? I mean, who's really looking at their magazine when they're in the heat of battle? Like, I'm usually focused on not getting headshot. But hey, for science, we checked it out. So, I grabbed my trusty P90 and started blasting away, paying close attention to the magazine. And guess what? As I kept firing, I could actually see the bullets disappearing one by one, right before my eyes. It was wild. I mean, normally I'm too busy dodging shots and trying not to get wiped out to even notice little details like this. But there it was, every shot I fired made the ammo in the mag go down, just like magic. It's crazy how the devs added such a small detail that you'd never really notice in the middle of a fight, but once you do, it's kinda mind blowing. So yeah, this myth is confirmed. So next time you're in game, instead of checking your kills, just stare at your mag and watch those precious bullets disappear. Second myth by its Chaco, the bow ammo is not actually arrows, its main ammo is sniper ammo. Okay, we've got another weird one from our friend its Chaco. Apparently, the bow and blood strike doesn't use arrows like a normal bow would. Now, according to this myth, it uses sniper ammo. Yeah, you heard me right. Sniper ammo for a bow. Like what? So, I dropped into Shutter Island, grabbed some cash like a loot goblin, and headed straight to buy myself a bow. Now, here's where things get interesting. As you guys can see, my bow is sitting at a sad zero ammo. Not a single arrow in sight. But here's the twist. Instead of looking for arrows, I'm going on a hunt for some sniper ammo. Sounds weird, right? But watch this. I finally found some sniper ammo, and boom, check it out. My bow is now loaded up with 10 ammo, even though it was completely empty just a second ago. This is insane. The fact that a bow uses sniper ammo, who would have guessed? This one's actually confirmed too. The bow does use sniper ammo, which makes absolutely no sense. But hey, it works, I guess. Maybe the devs wanted to make things extra spicy. So, if you're running low on arrows, just think, sniper bullets are now your best friend. Third myth by operator controls, go to the beach at a distance far away until you see a city. This next one feels like something out of a dream. Imagine being so deep into the game that you just wander off to a beach, and bam, there's a city out in the distance. I mean, it sounds like a secret easter egg or something. So, I landed right on the edge of the map in Shutter Island, and almost immediately, I could start seeing a city way off in the distance. To make things clearer, I hopped into a helicopter and flew even further toward it. And now, I can clearly see the city, it's right there, standing tall. But here's the catch, I can't go any closer because the zone's closing in and stopping me from getting any further. It's like the game's teasing me with a city I can't actually reach. Myth confirmed. Fourth myth by its Chaco, Volt's ability can destroy Ethan's shield. Alright, this one's for the tactical geniuses out there. The myth says that Volt's electric ability can totally fry Ethan's shield, leaving him wide open for attack. So, to test this myth, I teamed up with one of my friends. We set up the experiment. First, I deployed my shield, feeling all safe and secure behind it. Then, my friend activated his ability, and boom. Just like that, his ability completely shattered my shield. I was left wide open, totally exposed. So yeah, 
The myth is definitely confirmed. Volt's ability really does break Ethan's shield like it's made of glass. If you're running Volt's, keep this in your back pocket. You never know when Ethan's going to think he's untouchable. Fifth myth by Yangtze Uniamv, you can go behind the training ground by using Rant's ability. This one sounded too good to be true. Apparently, you can glitch behind the training ground using Rant's ability. Like, really? Are we breaking the game now? So, I headed into the training ground and picked Ran, ready to test this myth. I activated her ability and went straight to the top, feeling all confident. Once I got there, I jumped, fully expecting to go behind the wall like the myth says. But nope. I hit an invisible wall, and I thought, okay, maybe I messed it up. So, I tried again, this time fully prepared. I made sure everything was perfect, jumped again, and still no luck. Turns out there's an invisible wall blocking the way, completely stopping me from going behind the wall. I even thought I had it for a second, but now that invisible walls had other plans. So yeah, this myth is busted, no sneaky shortcuts for Ran here. Sixth myth by Diabloisit, you can't aim while reloading the P90 gun. Alright, P90 users. Let's put this myth to the test because we can't have any unfair disadvantages, right? So, I grabbed my trusty P90 and started firing away. Then, I went ahead and reloaded, thinking I could keep my aim down sights, ADS, without any issues. But nope, my aim was immediately cancelled. At first, I thought, okay, maybe it's just my settings messing with me. So, I dove into my settings and turned off the reload interrupt ADS option, thinking that would fix everything. But guess what? I tried again, reloading my P90 while still aiming down sights, and it still cancelled my ADS. For those of you who are curious, if you've turned off the reload interrupt ADS setting, you can reload most weapons while still aiming down sights. However, with the P90? Yeah, it doesn't work that way. No matter what, reloading this gun will always cancel your ADS. So, if you're a P90 fan, keep that in mind, you're not aiming down sights while reloading with this bad boy. Myth confirmed. Seventh myth by Sumita Samanta, Zerg can pass through Ran Ice Wall using Zero's active skill. This one had me curious. Zerg can apparently use his active skill to pass right through Rant's Ice Wall like a ghost. What is this, some superhero movie now? Let's check it out. So, my friend mentioned that this trick used to work before, but apparently, the devs have patched it. Still, I couldn't resist trying it out for myself. I mean, who wouldn't want to see if you can really phase through an ice wall? So, my friend set up Rant's Ice Wall, and I went ahead and used zero skill to try and pass through. And guess what? It didn't work. I couldn't get through the wall no matter what I tried. Now, I'm not sure if I performed the combo perfectly or if I missed something, but from what I saw, this trick just doesn't work anymore. So yeah, I'm pretty confident this myth is busted. You're not walking through any ice walls with zero skill, at least not in this version of the game. Eighth myth by Pixelaris, all bots in training have no shield except the one hidden behind. This myth claims that all the bots in training are completely shieldless except for one sneaky bot hiding at the back. Sneaky little bot, huh? So, I went into the training ground and wiped out every single bot, and I didn't see any sign of a shield on any of them. They were all going down like butter. But then, I spotted one sneaky bot hiding behind a wall. I aimed at it, fired a few shots, and boom, there it was, a shield break animation. And guess what? It's confirmed. All the front bots are as soft as marshmallows, but there's one bot in the back with a shield, just waiting to surprise you. So, next time, take a closer look before you start shooting everything in sight. Ninth myth by Sin Reaper, you will get killed by a vehicle drop. So, I dropped into Shutter Island. I went around collecting enough cash to buy a vehicle drop, but then I realized, these things are crazy expensive. A whopping 10k just to call in a vehicle. So, I had to grind a little more, picking up cash from every corner of the map. 
Finally, after what felt like forever, I had enough to buy a vehicle drop. I purchased it, and the drop started coming in. But then, out of nowhere, a bot decided to stroll up and get all up in my business. So, naturally, I had to take care of him. After taking him down, I realized I wasn't standing beneath the vehicle drop like I had planned, total fail. So, what did I do? Collected another 10k, yeah, again, and bought a second vehicle drop. This time, I made sure to stand perfectly still, right under the vehicle as it came down. And guess what? Nothing. The vehicle landed right on top of me, and I didn't take a single point of damage, not even 1 HP. I literally just spawned on top of the vehicle like it was no big deal. So yeah, the myth is busted, getting hit by a vehicle drop and blood strike won't hurt you at all. Tenth myth, Emma's beetle is named Luna. So, in my last video, I wasn't sure whether to confirm this myth or not, so I kind of just left it hanging. But oh man, the comment section went wild. People flooded it, telling me over and over that Emma's beetle drone is named Luna. After seeing so many comments, I figured, okay, this has to be true. But, being the myth buster that I am, I still wanted to check it out for myself. So, I jumped into the game, picked Emma, and deployed her beetle drone. I was listening super carefully for that voice line. Luna, you've got this! Luna, you've got this! And sure enough, she says, Luna, you got this. Clear as day. So, after all those comments and a quick test, I can officially say this myth is confirmed. Emma's beetle drone is definitely named Luna. And that's all 10 myths, busted or confirmed. Let me know in the comments which one shocked you the most, or if there's a myth you want me to try next. And hey, if you're still watching, you're an absolute legend. Hit that like button, smash subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace out.